first we need to add up all the totals so that means the total for the total column the total for the postage column the total for the stationary column and so forth now let's go ahead and do that there we go then we need to number our expenses which we will enter in our general ledger so postage will be n5 stationary will be n6 travel expenses will be n7 and sundry expenses will be n8 now we can restore our impressed amount but now how do we do that we do that by taking the amount in our total column and subtracting our $31 that we received for stationery. so let's go ahead and do that so 334 less our $31 will give us $303 and this $303 is our impressed amount now let's go ahead and enter that so on the 31st we will restore our petty cash book with $303 the description in the details column will be cash and in our folio column we will enter CB1 which stands for cash book so now let's add up the total of our receipts column when we do that we get $734 now we need to get our closing balance for April 2018 we get our closing balance by doing the following we take the $734 we just calculated and we subtract that by the $334 which is the amount in our total column and then we get our $400 which will be our closing balance now let's go ahead and enter this transaction there we go in our polio column we will enter carry down the description in our details column will be balance and the amount will be $400 and then we carry that to May 2018 on the first we will have an opening balance of $400 again so just like at the start of April 2018 at the start of May 2018 the petty cash book will again start with an opening balance of $400